If you're in the market for a boat that you can take your entire family out into the ocean on to enjoy a day on the water, you've probably got a lot of questions about what features do I need in a boat to make everybody happy. Well, Savannah Boat Works has taken a lot of the guesswork out of that for you in their new 2900 center console. We're going to dig into some of those features right now. I'm George Labonte and this is Mission Boating. Today on Mission Boating, our host, Captain George Labonte, takes a ride on the Savannah 2900, a center console boat sporting a V-bottom hull. Designed to accommodate angling families with an itch to venture into blue water, she features ample seating and storage, plenty of shade, and a noticeably soft ride. The Savannah 2900 has an overall length of 29 feet, a beam of 9 feet 6 inches, and a max horsepower rating of 700. With a draft of 22 inches, a dead rise of 23 degrees, a dry weight of 7,000 pounds, and a fuel capacity of 280 gallons, she can easily charge beyond sight of land and keep everyone on board comfortable, safe, and entertained. Now, let's check in with our host to learn more about the Savannah 2900. Now, for a perfect family boat, there's going to be at least three things that you're going to have to consider and features that you'll need to include on a boat. And it starts right here with seating. If you've got a family and a bunch of kids running around on the boat, you're gonna need adequate seating for everybody. And if you don't, people are not gonna be comfortable and your day is gonna end a lot quicker than you might like it to. So we've gotta have plenty of seating on the boat. Let's dig into why seating is so important for a family-oriented boat. You're gonna need seating for a couple of different things and in a couple of different venues. And one of those things is gonna be just sitting around socializing, like here at the sandbar, or if you're just drifting somewhere, just enjoying the day. An area where a bunch of people can sit around and talk to each other and kind of interact is really important. And obviously this large U-shaped seating up here and the included double seat there that's on the front of the console facing forward makes a nice area to do just that. You can sit in here and it doesn't have to be a big crowd. I mean, one person might wanna just sit there and stretch out and get a little bit of sun or two people next to one another. But either way, you can seat one or two or as many as five or six people up here in a social environment. And that's gonna make everybody a lot more comfortable than having to just stand up on the boat and talk. Now, another kind of seating that's gonna come in handy on a boat is seating for when you're underway and a perfect place for you to be seated when you're underway on a boat is all the way back here in front of the engines. Across the transom, this bench seat provides you a really comfortable place to sit while the boat's moving really fast. And that's basically the center of the gravity of the boat here is gonna really provide you the most stable ride you're gonna find on the boat back here. There's also two seats at the helm and obviously somebody's gotta be seated up there, but back here for your crew, your family, the kids, whatever, to sit here is a really comfortable spot. Now, if you're gonna bring kids along on the boat, one of your main concerns is gonna be, obviously, their security and safety on board. And that's addressed in a couple of different ways on the Savannah 2900. And it starts right here with the gunnel height. This freeboard and this high gunnel height behind me illustrates how easy it is to not worry about your kids running around in the boat. There's no way a little kid's gonna climb up out of this boat and go overboard on the thing by accident. And it's just probably not even in the cards in any scenario. Um, in addition to that, you know, they jump up and get into the seating and running around and get a little bit restless. You've got deep seating like a well here with a high seat back. And even there, if they're seated, you're in a comfortable spot well within the boat, not easily thrown overboard. Now, last and certainly not least, when it comes to comfort on a boat, one thing that definitely can't be overlooked is having really adequate shade. Protection from the sun is really going to make a difference in how your day shakes out. Try spending the day on an open boat without any shade and watch how long everybody gets tired of being out there. It happens fast, believe me. Having a hard top that's big enough to put a lot of people underneath and get everybody out of the sun is really critical. And the 2900 from Savannah Boat Works definitely has got you covered in that department. This is a big top that's gonna to give a number of people an opportunity to get out of that sun and get a little bit of relief from this tropical heat that I'm experiencing right now. That's really critical and that's just gonna make your day go a lot smoother and make you able to last a lot longer on the boat without the need to go back and just call it a day.
Okay, if you're a family that goes boating, the first thing you're gonna realize is that you've got a lot of equipment that you have to take along with you and you're gonna need a place to put all that equipment. Whether it's beach towels, food, drinks, I mean, toys to play on in the water, all your fishing gear, whatever it is, you're gonna need a spot to put all of it. And this boat addresses that in a couple of different ways and it starts right up here. You've got two nice sized dry storage compartments in the front underneath the seating and an extra set of them in the deck right here behind, at the front of the console basically. So those two things are places where you can put stuff that you need immediate access to throughout the day. Now you're gonna find you have a lot of storage needs that involves big items that you don't need immediate access to throughout the day. And a large item like a big tote bag full of beach towels or any big cumbersome things will fit nicely inside the console. There's a lot of storage space in the console on this 2900 and you can put stuff in there and put it away and forget about it. But another nice thing to point out about the size of the storage in here is there's plenty of room for a head and there's one included on this model. There's also a pull out shower in there too and those are both really good comfort features for a family boat in any scenario. Now finally, for things that you need access to throughout the day, little items like fishing tackle, sunscreen, a place to put your cell phone down or a camera and get it out of the weather, Savannah's really taken that into account on this boat. And not only this tackle station, the area behind the helm seat is gonna be a good place for tackle items and whatnot, but space under the gunnels, there's a lot of little cubby holes tucked all throughout the boat everywhere for fire extinguishers, a hose, wash down. I mean, just random items for Plano boxes, overhead electronics, an overhead box on the underside of the hardtop. All of these things provide a great place to put things like your keys and a camera and all that other stuff. Now, although we're talking about primarily family comfort features on this model, there's very little likelihood you're gonna buy a boat like this and not ever wanna go fishing on it. And you can certainly fish very capably on the 2900. They've included a really big live well on this boat, a couple of giant insulated fish boxes in the deck, and of course, rod holders back here and plenty of tackle storage. And if you're the type that wants to go out and just catch a couple of dolphins for dinner, I mean, you're absolutely covered with all the stuff they built into this 2900 model. Now, each of the things that I've outlined here that are going to make this a practical family boat for you will play a role in the enjoyability of your day and overall in the big picture. The one thing they all have in common is they're going to make everybody on the boat safe and comfortable. And comfortable is going to go a long way on a boat with a family. It's just gonna make your day last longer and just contribute to the overall experience. Each of those things has a role and they all, on this model, do it really well. I'm George Labonte from Mission Boating and this is the 2900 from Savannah Boatworks. Mission Boating, the ultimate marine resource.